in science error is just a natural part of discovery. And it wasn't a huge error. The consequences were reasonably mild. I mean, I don't believe anybody died as a result of this mistake or sustained any serious injury by standing like this. Um, so I don't call this a failure because, of, because the premise of the talk is wrong. I think it's a failure because so far Ted failed to correct for the error. They didn't take down the talk. Instead, they posted this statement, which I'm pretty sure most viewers didn't see, and which they promised to keep up to date, and they don't. They just let Cuddy to have the last word. And I understand them. 60 million views are very, very important. And there are loads of people still peddling this power poses nonsense. I hear this at every other soft skills gathering event. Luckily, not at this one, as far as I can remember. Now, this is how you lose trust as an institution. This is when the slow demise begins. And I believe this is the case where truth was completely overshadowed by good storytelling, by great storytelling. This is where storytelling becomes dangerous, when we stop caring about the facts and start caring about the entertainment or, I don't know, political value of the message. This is the real danger of storytelling. The real danger is not that stories don't work. They work spectacularly well. The real danger is that they work too well. They work so well that form completely overshadows the substance. This is not okay.